What's happening, chess fans? Welcome to Net Chess and Chill. Today is episode number six of my Rapid Rating Climb series, and we are on our journey to 1200 ELO. So, if you guys have been watching my channel, um, last episode I did win. I'm wearing the same clothes because I filmed another episode back to back. So, um, yeah, we're trying to get right back over a thousand where we belong and uh, start working our way towards that 1200 goal. So, if you guys enjoy my content, please like and subscribe. And without further ado, let's get into today's game. All right. You guys like music? I like music. We're going to play some music. We're also going to see who we're going to be playing today. Jupe, Jupap Drummer. Good luck, my friend. We will play a, uh, a London. Jupap Drummer is from Bosnia and Herzegovina. I've never seen that flag, and that is super interesting to me. So I always think that this is a weird, a weird order of operations. Um, I'm gonna bring my bishop out. I feel like knight in front of your c7 pawn is not ideal, but I'm sure he's gonna play this move, which is something. We'll play e3. I'm sure his bishop is going to come out. He's playing for kind of tricks. Um, I could play an, a move like... Okay. So he gets his other knight developed, which is cool. Does he want to play this move? Looks like he might. If he plays this move now, I take... He takes. I take. So it doesn't really work for him. Um, I could get my bishop here just anyways, so he can't bring his bishop to this square. <clears throat> then he'll probably put his bishop here. Let's see. I think I'm gonna... Try not to spend this much time in the opening. That's probably a good good idea. We'll just get this knight involved here. Could play a move like this if his bishop comes here, which actually now it might. So now I can see this white squared bishop ending up here. Oh my gosh. He's going to fianchetto his bishop. Now that I've moved my knight here. Interesting. Well, I'm going to get my light squared bishop out, get this knight up here, and, uh, yeah. I, I guess he might have an idea of doing something like that, but that's not really going to work, because I'm just going to play this. Well, then he can take. So I can play a move like this. Yeah, I can't play this, because he'll take, and I don't want that. So I'm going to play this. He'll probably play this move. I'll back up. So we're pinning this pawn to the queen right now. <clears throat> we're almost fully developed. So now he's going to play this move. He does I'm gonna take the uh, knight I think
I take the knight with my queen. I think I will do that. And then we'll recapture with the queen. Probably castle queen side now. Um, definitely want to get my knight involved and probably castle. I might castle king side. I really haven't decided yet. attacking that I can't really protect it with my queen <clears throat> play a move like this which is kind of slow but I definitely don't want his rook getting in almost ha are giving me a little trouble with my queen though hmm Got some light squared weaknesses right here for sure. Yeah, he's kind of like trapping my queen. gonna take back with the knight or the king okay so we're gonna castle queen side for sure Ooh, and he got me with the fork got me with the fork not good We're equivalent material, but he's up a piece. I have a lot of pawns for it. <clears throat> Yikes. There's a plan to go. Definitely don't want to be trading. If he takes, I'll take. If he takes this way, I'll take. Yeah, that was bad that I lost a piece. I really don't want to be trading right now at all. So I need to tighten up. Um,
I don't know why he did that. Gave me back the piece. So if I take, he can't take with the bishop, he has to take with the pawn. I can put more pressure on it that way. Could also just play this move. Which is maybe alright. <clears throat> I have a funny move like that as well. I think we will take, and I'll play this. So, his idea is to put pressure on this pawn with this with this move. I can block with my knight as well, but I think I'm going to do this, put pressure here. And I have a move like this. <clears throat> All right, so my opponent stops that. Um, I'm gonna play this move. And maybe start pushing pawns. Um, I, pr okay. I think this works with check. Now I have this move. Also can just get my bishop tied in and then play this move, which is probably a little bit safer for me. We're up two pawns, but that doesn't mean anything in this position. Oh God. And it begins. I might need to bring my rook back down. My opponents were running out of moves. <clears throat> so if I played this move he can go here. I think right now is when I move the bishop. He gave me a chance to do it, so I think I should take take that in stride. And I think we'll play b3 maybe next.
start getting my king out. I'm attacking this pawn. Doubling up my rooks. I'm going to take the pawn, threatening the bishop. Bring maybe this rook over to here. Or I could play a move like this, maybe. I don't think so. That's not a good move. So my opponent wants to bring his rook into here. Um, I don't really have a good way to stop that, do I? This is tough for me. Um, keeping an eye on things. Is this pawn going to be a bad pawn to grab? Probably. I'm gonna just do it. I'm about to get checkmated. He can just move anywhere. If he goes here, I gotta move back. I do this to myself all the time. I think I have to take the bishop and then I could play a move like this. Oh man. I need to push pawns. It's my only hope. He's just gonna move here in his checkmate, and I don't have any way to defend it.
Hmm. Good game. Let's uh, let's check the game review. I'm, I played pretty god awful game there. Um. So already we're off to a bad start. Um. So yeah, I had a uh, trouble in, immediately with this. Giving up that pawn is just apparently fine because I can castle on the next move. Oh man, bad move. Um, just getting getting everything tight is better. Um, I lost to this fork. So, oh yeah, but what about that? The computer is so crazy with its moves. Hmm. So he just gave me a piece, and then I literally didn't convert it correctly. So this is the wrong idea. This should be a better idea, um, because none of the complications of what I did come into effect. Like, like that happened. I just developed my knight, which is a great idea. This is a miss. Just taking the bishop is a better idea. He needs to take. If he doesn't take, if he takes this... I just take and I'm in, ooh, actually I can't take. If he takes this, I can take back with the pawn. If he takes this, yeah. I guess I can move the bishop, yeah. Okay. So this is what happened. Um, I went for the check. Wasn't even the best move. The best move is just taking and not caring about this for some reason. I literally can only like slide over here. So seems dangerous. Um, This just makes so much more sense. Yeah. Tough. So, I'm just completely lost here. Um, definitely not the best move. Get the rook onto the file. Definitely the better move. There's really no winning in this position. I'm completely lost. So, very tough. Um, <laughs> rough time with all this stuff. I will play one more game, and we will see if we can't just get that win right back. Seems like we're going to be waiting for... A game again. All right, we're playing with the black pieces. Muhammad BLD, good luck. We play a Karl Khan defense. Will we get the advanced? Yes, we will. C5 is what I like to play in the advanced. I like to then get my knight out. I like to pin this knight. Play E. Okay, if they want to do it that fast. We have a move like this. Next move. I 
I don't know what they're thinking about. They have to take. Or they don't. So we'll get the night out. We will put pressure on this pawn. Um, I don't really want to give up the bishop here. Um, I like that the knight can't come in right now, so my opponent can't put the bishop here because I can just take it. Also, this pawn is hanging. Hits the queen. She has to prob... Okay, so he defends it with a knight. He's got a block with the bishop. Or just move the king. Either way, we're taking his castling rights away, it looks like. I'm going to castle, and then this looks like what I want to play. Putting pressure here and on this pawn and defending this pawn. Um, this comes with check. Um, this he takes, I can take. And I'm still got pressure on this pawn and probably this pawn. <clears throat> Completely even. So it looks like he wants to win this pawn. But I don't think it works because I'll have check here. So I'm threatening the queen right now, so he's got to take. Also, I think I just had this, but <clears throat> I think this is a little better, maybe. Also, a move like that is something I could have thought about. We're playing really fast, so I probably need to slow down. Whenever I play a game and I lose, or even if I win, I get kind of irritated. Um... So I think I have to take, and then we can
bring a rook over. Um, I think that I have this check. If he goes here, I can win. Ooh, I can't win the pawn now. My king is a lot safer than his king, though. But I think that I can start pushing the pawn. I'm going to push the pawn. I think the doubling up is also not a terrible idea. I don't know if this move works. I guess it does. He takes. Or he just moves his queen. I think it does work. I'm gonna drop down here maybe, and give a check. Maybe here. So I have this move. But then he can take. I guess he really can't do that. So we're up two pawns. Kind of scary though. Well, that is just losing for my opponent. King out.
should be a completely winning end game for us. Um, I guess I could have just taken. That probably was a way better move. I don't know. Maybe not. Because then they have two connected pawns. One's a passer. So now this move... bring my king seems like my opponent wants to go for a stalemate but I'm just not gonna allow it Alright, so we got one back. It's hard to gain ELO, man. Chess is hard. So we played a much better game that game, 87.6%. Played a Karo Khan, they played it in advanced. I play C5, I bring my knight out, they bring their knight out, I go for the pin. Typically, they pin me as well, or they attack my bishop, I take, he takes, I then reinforce my center, um, which is apparently not even the best move, just taking is the best move. Um, immediately and if they take back we have this but instead instead we come to this position where I still take they take I take or er, yeah and they take and this is an annoying two pawns right but they're not protected by anything the queen is in front of the F pawn so they're gonna have to use pieces or move their queen and um, I just get my knight out they defend with their knight I found bishop check he takes I ruin his castling rights and from here I felt pretty comfortable because my king is safe and his is in the middle of the board um, I think this is just a better move all around maybe not rook over so giving up this pawn which is kind of awesome I don't see moves like that very well. I took, he played this, I took, he took. I then reinforced with my rook, which I could just push right here, apparently. He takes, I take. I don't like that, I wouldn't have pushed. Um, now that I'm defended enough, I give this check. I push the pawn right here, which is not the best move. Backing my queen up is a better move. Just not caring about... Like, he can't take right now, obviously, but... Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Queen there is a weird move for me. I get it. So, the queen here was setting up this to win the queen. I like that. And then you push this move. Pretty cool move. Um, yeah, I didn't see that. I gave this check, which is not the best. What's the best? Taking the free pawn. Yeah, so I did that right after I gave the check. Boom, take the pawn. They come in. 
crazy sacrifice. The weird thing about this is my queen covers, so it doesn't really work. He takes, I take, he takes, I take. And now I just have a rook and he has nothing. So put my rook behind the passed pawn and yeah, we just, you know, win everything, eat all the pawns and then threaten to just push this pawn the whole way. So play pretty well. Says I played like a 1450, which is far, I mean, literally double the ELO of my last game. The last game I played said I played like a 700, I think, so or an 800. So we are having trouble with consistency. So I think that I'll start studying some puzzles and then some of the opening lines that I'm not very good at. So maybe we'll do that on like one of my Twitch streams. If you guys don't follow me on Twitch, Go follow me on Twitch. We play Blitz. We have a ton of fun there. Um, I play games with you guys on, you know, on Twitch. And, uh, yeah, I'm usually there for, like, an hour, two hours, something like that. And uh, it's fun. So I stream on Tuesdays and on the weekends as well. So um, Friday, Friday included. So Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and then Tuesday. So if you guys are interested in that, feel free to go follow my Twitch and, uh, you guys can join the Discord if you have any questions or anything. We have a small community in there where we just chat. We're all real cool people, and it's fun. You know, we all talk chess, show show our games sometimes, ask questions. It's good. So, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and we'll have some better luck tomorrow. See you then.